Okay, what we're going to try and uh, present this time is a quick presentation using Sketch Sketchbook Pro. Uh, we're just going to show you how to do a very simple uh, block model using the various commands. You see here we're just using the pen tool, creating a layer, and then just easily blocking out using the straight line setting the line work on it. Now we're just going to throw in a background plate on a lower layer using the marker tool to create a base wash on the shaded face. Now over to the lit face we've changed the colour slightly just to convey that change in lighting. Again using the straight line tool. The good thing about Sketchbook Pro is it's good for concept level sketching. It's not as complex as Photoshop and a fraction of the cost uh, to purchase. So for concept level sketches or situations where you've got a tight budget, this is a, a pretty useful piece of uh, kit to keep in on your computer. Okay, we're just... Uh, Doing the top now, lit face, so we've taken the same base colour and just lightened it slightly. There you go. So we're just going to trim the edges off. Okay, we've switched off the underlying line work and we're now using the erase tool just to clean up the edges a little bit just to sharpen things up so you'll see that the the approach to it is not dissimilar to what you do with a traditional rendering which makes the transition between this and uh, between traditional drawings and uh, computer aided drawings uh, relatively seamless. Now we've just created a new layer. We're creating the highlight line. Create a sense of light reflecting off the corner edge. Throwing in a highlight using the airbrush setting. Right on the corner there. A little bit of a secondary highlight. Now we've created a new layer. We want the uh, object to be grounded. Now you can do this off a, a scanned image, the, the basic rendering style is, is the same, but in this particular case we've just drawn it quickly in the computer from scratch. Just using the airbrush tool again, changing to the eraser to clean the edges off so we've got a better looking shadow. There we go. And that's it.